I was on my way to Japan for a Kinder Egg date with Podolsky. Uh huh. Excuse me, weird woman creature looking thing? What's the in flight movie? It's the same movie every flight! Vicky Christina and Yatta! Vicky Christina and Yatta! What was that? That's nothing that concerns you! I need to see what that is! Only first class passengers! That's first class? Well, guess what? This is fifth class! When does not just Gandhi? What's up, big boys, and welcome to, and I can't believe I'm legitimately saying this, the 96th end of era Andres Vicky Cristina Iniesta episodia. Yesterday, EA released this end of era 96 rated Iniesta card, um, honoring obviously him being coming to an end of an era. Gonna be obviously going to Japan, uh, playing with Podolsky and uh, and Fernando Torres, aka El Nino. But they released this end of era card. We actually played eight games with him on stream yesterday. You guys will see right here: eight games played, five shots, uh, five goals, four on target. So nine goal contributions and eight matches not great um, but uh, also want to thank you guys for popping by the stream yesterday uh, I think we streamed for something like six hours on uh, over on Twitch so I appreciate the support there but we are here today to honor this absolute Barca legend it looks like we're probably gonna be getting ourselves a few more end of era cards before FIFA 18 ends and the question of the epi is not only if you guys have completed his SBC we've done the loan we're gonna play out the 12 matches and then see if we want to continue with it which we will probably do, he's 250,000 coins. But the question of the episode yeah, of other end of era cards that might be coming out, you guys let me know in the comment section below who you else would like to see. I saw G is a legend, aka Jizza, aka the SBC guru, uh, predict that maybe Pair Murdersacker could get one. That would be an incredible, incredible card to get, maybe a plus 85 pace uh, Pair Murdersacker card. That would probably be one that I would be looking forward to as well. Maybe even a Podolsky. I know he got himself a classic European hero card. If you guys are hyped for the end of era cards, if you guys want to see more of those, smash that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, as always, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Now, let's take a quick look at his stats. He's got 99 attacking positioning and probably the most surprising, given that it's, not, it's a 96 rated card, 94 finishing is insane, 72 stamina when you consider Kaka and Pirlo have like 50 stamina, 72 is not bad at all. Passing stats for days, uh, long shots, shot power, he's got it all. 86 agility for 98 dribbling, you would expect that to maybe be a little bit higher, but he does have the 99 ball control, 98 dribbling, so we're going to keep an eye on that. And then of course, the 96 composure, which any end of era card has crazy, crazy composure. Most of them have 95 plus rate of and of of course, we had to put him into a Barca throwback squad. We've got the classic European hero, uh, Barca rated version, uh, Samuel Eto'o on 7 chem. We've got our first owner, guaranteed Liga Santander pull, 98 youngster Messi. We've got the 96 Iniesta up at cam, and then Ronaldinho, of course, obviously one of the Barca legends as well. Uh, didn't, d didn't, didn't know how we could figure a way to get uh, Henri in there, obviously, but the four of them sort of played it at, at differing times. I think they were all on the same team for maybe like a year or two. But uh, it was really the combination of Iniesta, uh, Eto, and then Messi, which was really, really crazy. Let's get to match number one. Let's see if that 96 rated card is as beast as it looks. Los Kids! Match number one, and he is taking full advantage of that. Well, not the new uh, Alessandrini. The new Alessandrini, I believe, is 86 rated with 97 pace. Looks absolutely disgusting. Iniesta. Referee! Messi. That pass though. one and I I don't fully understand it three shots on target for him four for us we're not able to we're not able to capitalize on our opportunities and uh, we're gonna need a much better effort here in the second half Iniesta bro I, I don't want to say that he's I don't want to say that he's not worth it by any means I mean he, he pulls off some pretty miraculous passes but nine again uh, uh, eight nine goal contributions in eight matches that's that's not a great ratio especially for a 96 rated cam usually a player that lights it up for us Finally! Finally! Okay, 10 goal contributions in 8 matches, perhaps maybe the most important goal that we've scored with him so far. 
Yo, and yes, dude, let's get a Hattie, dude. On tre kakya. Eto, I, uh... What a strike. Okay, come on, and yes, is heating up. How? Bro, 98 Messi missed one on, uh, missed one of those on stream yesterday as well. How does a 98 rated striker Messi miss that? I, I don't understand, he's got 99 finishing. Samuel Eto and Yesta gets one. Eto gets one. The only guy missing on the board right now is Messi, and they haven't been clinical finishes at all. The only one that the only one that felt incredible was the Iniesta, the Iniesta leveler. Messi, and then a beautiful little send, and then Timmy Howard right between the legs. Uh, the Meg goal. Two one. We get ourselves the comeback victory. Iniesta proved himself. You know he got himself. Uh, uh, Messi got the two goal, uh, two assists, and then Iniesta got himself a goal, as did Samuel Eto'o. So a nice little uh, throwback Barca performance from the boys right there. Ten shots, eight on target, 52% possession. Feel like we deserve to win that. Not a lights out performance from the boys. Let's see if we can get it in match number two. Match number two, he's got the team of the season, Memphis Depay. He's got Keita Baldedio, and he's got himself that 90 rated Adebayor. Interesting little fact, Toko Akambi, uh, 90 rated Eto'o is not the highest rated Cameroon striker in Ultimate Team. There's a, there's a Cameroon player, uh, Toko Akambi, who has himself a 92 rated striker card, and I had no idea that that card existed. Wait for it. Oh, Messi! Okay, I know that's, I know that's a tough angle, dude, but we gotta have that. <laughs> I don't know what, it, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is about Eto'o and Messi that they can't finish. They can't finish like clear cut opportunities. That's it. Yeah, apparently, apparently Lecomte is the best keeper in the game. <laughs> Come on! Lecomte, bro! Let one of these in! Alright, this is the battle of the keepers. This match is going to be decided by how many saves keepers can make. This is nuts. This is absolutely crazy. Apparently match number two is not going to be featuring Iniesta or 98 Messi or 90 uh, Eto for that matter. It is going to feature 89 Ter Stegen and whatever rating Lokomte is. A combined nine shots on target, zero goals scored, but of those nine shots on target, like 80% of them were very, very high opportunity chances, and both Lecomte and Ter Stegen have played out of their minds. Oh, God! Cruz, that ball was going one mile per hour. How are you not catching up to that? Without you standing next to me, I am the lock and you're the key. Ah, uh. release me from my insanity. And that's the goal we concede. That that's okay. All right. Uh, yeah, all right. This song goes out to my boy Eto. Loves He's got the that boat. ability go. to spot yes, angle. Girls, see, see does this. A rolling on here for Eto! Oh, oh Samuel Eto! 90th minute equalizer from and Samuel, the Eto fish, Eto. And we get ourselves fish. another. No, surprise, surprise. Uh, very similar, not to his famous goal. Obviously, that was a lot crazier. It was a one time finish. It was a one time pop about 20 yards out. A similar curl, but way to the left. 
And uh, we're, we're gonna have to use that sound clip. 17 shots, 11 on target. And somehow we only managed to draw it level in the uh, in the dying embers of the match. It's extra over extra time here. We're, we're winning this. The, this is a three one -er. What a finish! Andres Iniesta! Come on! 103rd minute, a beautiful send from his teammate Eto. Fabra. Oof, wait, who was that? Was that. What, that wasn't his Camille Glick. No, was that his. I don't know who that was. That was, looks like it might have been Matteo. Okay. Jesus, I was about to say borderline racism, dude. Are you kidding me? That's it. 3 1. Called it. 3 1, boys. Let's go. Finessis, that's it. This was the Finessi episode. Kus, Eto, Messi, uh, Iniesta. I Iniesta was the star. I, I, you know what? I might actually say that Eto was the star because he provided the assist that drew it level. Iniesta, obviously, incredible finish. But then, uh, then Eto scored us a goal to take the lead in extra time. So I feel like he needs a lot of credit because he has the goal and the assist. We get the rage quit 9.4 and deserve 9.4. Doesn't get man of the match. But, sorry, does get the man of the match. 9.4. Uh, for Eto, and then we get the uh, goals from Iniesta Cruz, and then Eto, as well as assist from Ramos Eto, and then Messi. So, uh, I would definitely say an improved performance. 20 shots, 14 on target. Was unlucky not to maybe bury four or five in there. Uh, his Lecomte came to play. His Lecomte was actually just insane. But uh, we do put together a nice little string of performances. So, 10 matches used with this Iniesta card. We have a combined. Uh, so what is that? That is going to be 11 goal contributions in 10 matches played. Again, we were on stream yesterday, so there might have been a little bit of added pressure. Uh, and then today, I think we tacked on three in two matches played. So I would say definitely worth getting the loan card, whether or not... I mean, at this stage of FIFA, we're towards the end. If you love Iniesta, spend the 300,000 coins. It's, I think it's between 200 and 300,000 coins for the SBC. I will probably complete it just because he is a channel legend and one of my favorite players in real life. Hated him throughout the entire maybe 2008 Euros, 2010 World Cup, 2012... Uh, Euros for uh, not treating Germany too kindly, especially at the 2008 Euros, but um, uh, alas, he is one of our favorite players of all time. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed the episode. I would definitely recommend trying him out. If you guys did enjoy the epi, hit that like button. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. I will see you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, boys. Tschüss. Later. Ade.